Hello my friends from YouTube, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to factory reset uh, this um, HP laptop. Uh, it's a HP 7265 NGW. Uh, doing this, uh, it also will, will remove the password, the administrator password, okay? Everything you do is in your own risk. I am not responsible for any damage that you cause to your devices. This uh, video is for education purpose only. Please, before you do anything about resetting your PC, uh, please back up your files, like um, documents, pictures, videos, and also um, the software that, um, that you install in this computer will be removed. So, that's why um, you need to back up your important files because everything will be removed. Um, I'm going to reset this um, computer to factory because um, it's causing me problems. It has like a virus and a, a lot of pop-ups coming out and malware. Okay, so, so to do this, we need to... Um, Turn on the, the computer right here. And then uh, we're gonna press right here. F11 right away, okay? F11 to do the factory. You see, right now it says, please wait. There will be um time when, uh, when I have to pause the video, so it won't be too long. Okay, from here, we need to go to uh, troubleshoot, okay? I try to make my video fast, not too long. So from here, you you need to go to uh, let's reset this PC. Let you choose keep or remove your personal files, and then reinstall Windows. We're gonna go here the first one because we we're going to reset. So press Enter in the keyboard because it's already selected. Or you always touch screen this one. This computer is touch screen, so you go to reset this PC or press enter in the keyboard. Okay, and from here, you need to read very carefully. Keep my files. Remove applications and series, but keep your personal files. Sometimes this is good uh, option, but but if uh, if you have virus in the computer, then uh, the virus is gonna be, it might be still in one of your application or files. So it's better to do this one if you have virus. If you don't have virus, then uh, you, sh you can do this one, but I'll remove everything, okay? Okay, right here, reset this PC. Save previsioning package that let this PC use workplace resources. No, remove provisioning package that let this PC use in a work, um, workplace resources. Um, I'm gonna do this this one because I don't want the virus to stay there. So I'm gonna click this one, and then another option: reset this PC. Do you want to full clean your drive? When you remove your files, you can also clean the drive so that the files can be recovered easily. 
This is more secure, but it takes much longer. Just remove my files. Use this if you keep your PC. You keep in this PC. Full clean the drive. Use this if you will recycle the PC. We are now going to recycle this PC, so I'm gonna keep it. So I'm gonna choose this one. Okay, so right now it's doing it. So right now it's removing everything. Okay, like I said, it's good good idea to back up your um, computer every two weeks, every month, depend how you use it. Because if you are um if you have um like important files and you don't save it, and let's let's say one day your computer don't turn on anymore, then you you will lose everything. Okay, reset this PC. All ready to go. Make sure that your PC is plugged in. Resetting will remove all the personal files and user accounts in this PC. Any app, apps and programs that, that you didn't come with, that it didn't come with this PC. Any changes made to the setting. Okay, so now that you are you are agree, then you click oh, right here, reset, and now it's gonna do it. So I'm gonna pause my video, that way it won't be too long, okay? But I I will uh, let you know what's, what's the next screen. You see right now it's a 19%. Okay, it's still, um, doing the reset 91 percent so let's wait a little bit okay okay right now it's restarting the computer um so let's see what's the next screen that we get. Okay, we got this one preparing. Installing Windows 0%. Don't turn off your PC. This will take a while. Okay, so let's pause the video again. Okay? Your region is set to the United States. Is that right? Okay, now we got this option so just gonna turn off the voice right here okay from here I need some light Okay, don't let me hold you up. Just pick the one you want from the list. Make your computer easier to use. Rest. Uncheck narrator, exiting narrator. Okay, let's select United States and click yes. Your keyboard is set to US. Want to stick with that? Yes. But is this the right keyboard? Yes. Do you also type with another keyboard layout? No, no, skip. Now let's get you connected to a network. That way you can get updates, apps, and cat videos as soon as possible. Skip for now. Just so you know, connecting to a network now could save you some time later. No. If you want to get that out of the way, choose yes. No. I want to connect it later. Next up. The legal stuff. In short, 
you'll need to select accept to use windows you can decline but then you know no windows accept Type what you want to name your account. Uh, right here, I'm going to click next. That's not a name you can use. Go. That's not a name you can use. Go ahead and try something else. Username, I'm going to type one. One and then click next. Okay, now type a password for your account. I don't want password, so let's see if I can skip it. Yeah, no password for now. Hey, look, that's me, Cortana. Can I have permission to use the info I need to do my best work? Decline. Windows can save your spot in apps, files, and websites, so you can keep doing what you were doing even when you switch devices. No. These are the settings Microsoft recommends. Go ahead and review them and select Accept when you're ready. Okay, Accept. Your device manufacturer would like your contact info to send you updates and such. I don't want I don't want it so use next. Right here share depends on you what do you wanna um, but read every page you get, okay? Almost done now. We just need to get a few more things polished up for you and Windows will be all yours. Looking forward to helping out. Okay, getting ready. It's gonna take a few minutes more, so I'm gonna pause it. Okay, right here. So it's asking you to register your uh, computer. I won't do it, so just uncheck and uh, skip here. And then uh, close this window. And then that's it, guys. And um, that's the way how you uh, factory reset um, your HP laptop. And um, and also you can do this when uh, when you forgot the password. But um, remember, everything will be removed from your computer. Okay, so as you see right now, it's um, working fine. See, look at. Okay, so everything is working. Okay, thank you so much for watching my video. Uh, please subscribe to my channel, give me a like, check my other videos. Thank you so much, and uh, have a great day.